Hello and welcome back to our next lecture from this course on how to create passive income from cryptocurrency. Right now we are on coinmarketcap.com. This is a platform that uh, basically it shows you different stats regarding the cryptocurrency industry, like the market cap for different tokens, for different uh, coins and so on. And uh, basically this is like a bonus lecture for you if you want to uh, get into, let's say, more advanced uh, things related to cryptocurrency that can generate income for you. Uh, there are a lot, of, a lot of ways in which you can do that. And one of them is basically investing in ICOs, exactly like IPOs for companies, which are initial price offerings. We have initial coin offerings. So there are different projects into the market based on the blockchain technology projects which create these tokens and these tokens basically it's like if you want a similarity like uh, taking shares or buying shares uh, for a company for a specific project right and on coinmarketcap.com you have here ICO calendar in the menu if you are going to click on the ICO calendar you can see which are the ongoing projects okay so for the companies that uh, you want to maybe invest, it shows you the projects in which you can invest. And then you have upcoming projects. And here you can check the upcoming projects. And you can see here the stage of the project. So what it is more exactly, is it like, uh, okay, initial coin offering or uh, dividend offering or anything like that, okay? or there are different different types of uh, let's say ways to raise money for these projects and what these people are basically doing is they are raising money by selling the tokens to invest in their project and to expand it right and if you do your analysis correctly uh, you can get a very good return on investment not to mention that some of them have an initial coin offering which lasts for about a week two weeks maybe uh, somewhere around that time and after that they have a token sale they are listed on a public on a public exchange okay so the token sales basically you take your share of the tokens and then it's publicly uh, it's it's publicly traded and you get a very good return on investment sometimes three four maybe even five times it there were uh, moments in the past when it was even higher okay and for example right now you can see the upcoming projects and there are plenty of them here Okay, and what you have to do, for example, is click on one of the projects. This one starts very, very soon. And you can see data about the ICO, the ICO price, the cap. So basically this is the soft cap. It's like a minimum amount that they want to get raised. Fundraising goal, they want to raise $150,000. Personal cap and so on, okay. And that's the information about like the statistics. And then you have news, social ratings, analysis. Okay, you also have an analyze here. We don't have this data yet for this ICO. And another thing that you can do is go ahead and check their website. Okay, you can see that they have a website here, odds.fi for this one. You click on the website, you'll be redirected, multi-chain options trading. Okay, simple, secure and decentralized. So this is basically a multi-chain options trading. Uh, and basically that's what they are launching. This is the project. Okay, and here you have different, uh, different information about the project. And the cool part is that you have this white paper. You can click on the link white paper and you can check more about the ICO. What we recommend is to check the white paper to see if you understand the project well, to check, to check the team. Okay, you want to see who's the team behind uh, the, the ICO or the project. It's important to have a good team which is, uh, which is popular. Maybe not necessarily from the standpoint of expertise because we also have a lot of experts in the world in different fields which uh, let's say are not that popular. The ones who are popular, very popular, and also their popularity somehow relates to their expertise fields are marketers, right? Because if a marketer is popular, then 
he probably knows marketing very well because he actually used it on his own branding, right? Uh, but it's important to have popular advisors from different fields of activity, especially from finance and not just finance, but from the field of activity where the projects uh, project will have its activity. Why? Because uh, if you have popular uh, popular advisors or popular people on the team, people who worked for probably bigger companies or which are recognized, uh, the, the project has more chances to get funds and to advance, right? So to, to become a big project and that what does that mean for you? The, the value of the tokens will increase, okay? The other thing you should look for is the roadmap. You want to see what they want to do with the company in the next years. So that's the thing with the ICOs. What we recommend you is because they are high risk to do your analysis properly. You also have token private sales, pre-sales and so on. You need to do your analysis very carefully because there were cases in the past where from different reasons, the projects did not work out. Okay, so the value of the coins or the tokens went down a lot, disappeared and so on. So you need to, to look at everything, the project, the team, uh, the partnerships and so on in order to do, uh, let's say, a de to, to, to have or to take a decent decision regarding investing in that ICO or not. And it's still a risk, okay? On the other hand, obviously, uh, the return on, or on the investment can be very high in a relatively short period of time. So coin market cap is one of the places where you can check out the list of ICOs. Another one is, uh, let's see, Chainlink. Okay, ICO drops, ICO drops, which is pretty, pretty, uh, let's say pretty interesting. It doesn't have as many ICOs announced as, uh, as the other one. And we also have ICO link, again, another, another platform that you can check out. You can see ICO listing here in the menu, upcoming ICO, ongoing, pre-ICO list and so on. So you can see what projects are upcoming here. Again, we recommend you to, to, to be very careful with this. This is not financial advice. We are telling you what is happening in the market. So it's an information. You have to do your research right, look, at the project, the team, uh, the partnerships, strategy, and so on, okay? Before taking a decision. And obviously after that, it's your decision, but it's a, it's a high risk, uh, it's a high risk uh, type of activity to say so. Okay, that's everything we wanted to, to show you about ICOs. Uh, we hope you enjoyed the information and we are looking forward to see you in other lectures as well.